Many new parents find it difficult to decide where their newborn should sleep. While some babies feel comfortable sleeping next to their mother, others love to sleep in their own cot. In some countries, it is also a practice to put the baby to sleep in a separate room. As a parent, you may choose any option that gives you the most peace of mind. However, whichever option you choose, one thing that remains of prime importance is that you set up your baby's bed right. In this video, we will show you how you can do just that. Choose a cot with retractable railings. The slats of the cot should not be very wide. Just about an inch apart is good. It will prevent your baby from sticking his limbs in between the slats. Next comes the mattress. Choose a firm mattress. Cotton lumpy mattresses are not suggested as they can increase the incidence of SIDS. A coil plus foam mattress would be the ideal choice. Put a rubber or plastic sheet between the bedding and the sheets to prevent soiling the mattress with leaks. Choose cotton bed sheets. Make sure that they fit snugly under the mattress and are not loose. If you have bumper pillows in the cot, then the same should be tied firmly to the slats. Remember, there should be nothing loose in the bed. Your newborn does not need a pillow, so no need to worry about that one. Finally, the sheet which will cover the baby. Again, make sure that the ends are firmly tucked in. When you put the baby to sleep, make sure his head is not covered. For the first few weeks of life, your baby will be breastfeeding a lot at night. In fact, mom's milk production is highest at night. So place your baby's bed near your bed for easy access. You can have a bassinet or you could choose a cot. The baby will outgrow the bassinet real fast, so a cot is more long term. Also make sure there are no stuffed toys on the bed. You may want to tie up a dangler over the baby's bed to keep the baby busy. Take care.